in the event of any road traffic accident, to determine that who is wrong or who is right, road traffic rules, road markings and road signs, have been established as a part federal law, so it is essential for all the drivers to understand the traffic rules, road traffic signs and road markings, in order to drive safely. Driving inside city limits. While driving. Inside cities driver will have to deal with junctions, intersections, roundabouts, traffic lights, pedestrians crossings. And most importantly driver should know the basic position while dealing with one-way traffic and two-way traffic. Basic positioning while going straight in two-way traffic. While dealing with two-way traffic the basic position of the vehicles should be towards right. By keeping right, driver would provide sufficient gap for the behind road users if they tend to overtake. Moreover, by keeping right, driver will have sufficient distance with the oncoming vehicles too. Basic positioning while continuing straight ahead and there are parked cars on the road. If in case there are parked cars on the right side of the road, check the mirrors, blind spots, turn on the left indicator and overtake, if there are no oncoming vehicles. Once you have overtaken then you need to move back to the right side of the road, in order to maintain the basic position for going straight. Basic positioning when turning right. Whenever you tend to turn right from the junction, you will have to move towards right, so that you could show your intentions by your positioning to other road users. Basic positioning when turning left. While turning left in any two-way or O-junction ahead the driver should move the vehicle towards the center line. While turning left the turning rule is applicable, which means that you have to stop and give way to the oncoming vehicles, if there is any. Then the following drivers who are continuing straight would have sufficient space for passing from right, along with that your position could clear your intentions of turning left as well. Positioning when turning right or left. While dealing with one-way traffic in several lanes you should always keep your car in the center of the lane. For going straight and turning right the extreme right lane should be preferred. For turning left and making U-turns the extreme left lane should be used. Road markings, arrows, help you to choose the correct lane for different directions at junctions. Positioning in one-way traffic. In one-way traffic, if you have intended to change direction in a short distance then you should position your vehicle in the correct lane well in advance. If you have intended to continue straight, then join the extreme right lane. In such junction where two vehicles are turning left at a time, and the space is not wide enough for both of them to turn left, you should have an eye contact with the other driver, and allow them to turn left out if your view is not clear, then don't take risk of turning. Positioning your vehicle in several lanes. Whenever you are about to deal with the junction ahead, choose the correct lane for your desired direction well in advance. For turning right be in the extreme right lane. For going straight continue in the extreme right lane, which is considered the safest lane. For turning left move to the extreme left lane. U-turn is only permitted from the extreme left lane. Roundabout. While entering to the roundabout priority should be given to the vehicles approaching from left. For turning right choose the extreme right lane, use right indicator and join the same lane, extreme right. For going straight be in the extreme right lane, do not use any indicator while entering. While turning left and making U-turn choose the extreme left lane and use left indicator, while entering for both. In the roundabouts there is an additional rule known as exit rule. According to the exit rule, whenever you are about to leave the roundabout, right indicator should be used. Inside the roundabout, lane changing, reversing, stopping and overtaking are not allowed. Use our right hand indicator, while leaving the roundabout. Beware of long vehicles in roundabout. Long vehicles are supposed to stick to their lanes, but in the roundabouts due to their turning radius they cannot continue with the same lane, as they will hit the curbstone with the rear wheels, to avoid hitting the curbstone's heavy vehicle drivers join the second lane inside the roundabouts. 
so do not enter the roundabout if the heavy vehicles have already entered. Scanning technique. If the driver doesn't shift the gaze to the sides while driving, a very limited vision will be resulted. So this is very important to keep checking the mirrors and keep shifting your gaze in order to have a clearer vision. Lane changing right and left. Jumping the cues. What does this behavior reflect? Irresponsible aggressive personality. Careless personality. It also endangers the driver himself and the other road users. Driving in lanes in congestion. Do not change lanes without a good reason. Usually in traffic congestion multiple collisions are very common, so lane discipline is very essential. Do not lose your patience while waiting in queues. Do not jump to other lanes impulsively as it could cause accidents. Keep scanning your surrounding as other impulsive drivers could be jumping to your. It is strongly suggested to check the mirrors after each 5 seconds of interval. Changing lanes and being overtaken. While changing lane, or if you are overtaking another vehicle you have to scan properly. The scanning sequence has to be as follow, check the center view mirror. Check the side mirror. Look over your shoulder. Turn on indicator. Check again the center view mirror, and then start moving to the other lane smoothly. If someone is changing lane towards your lane then show positive attitude, slow down and allow them. If you are being overtaken then maintain the same speed, if required slow down, do not accelerate as it could cause hazards. Note, overtaking is only allowed from left side. Driver's behavior while changing lanes. Whenever someone turns on the indicator to change lane towards your lane, adapt your speed and accommodate them. Never overtake. Never overtake a vehicle, if it is turning on the road, or before at any uncontrolled junction, pedestrian crossing or intersection may overtake from right side if the vehicle in front of you has clearly indicated by visual signal and its position on the road that it is about to turn left. A crossroad controlled by a traffic light. Usually while driving on uphill the vision will be restricted, that's why such roads are marked with combination of solid continuous lines along with broken lines. Do not overtake if the solid line is on your side. Elderly and disabled pedestrians. Being inside the car, the shell or the body of the car is protecting us. But pedestrians, children and cyclists are unprotected road users. This is our responsibility to protect them. Respect disabled and elderly people. Children in traffic. Give extra care to children because. Children are always playing. They are impulsive. Their eyesight is not fully devolved yet. Inside city watch for the children. Stopping and parking. Never stop your car at a place where it might obstruct the view for others. Stopping and parking. Never stop your vehicles along with the curbs if the color of the curbstone is red. This area is meant for firefighting engines to attach the hose pipes with fire hydrants. Waiting, stopping, and parking. Stopping means to stop for a certain time to pick or drop someone. Waiting means to stop the vehicle and wait for some time. Waiting should never be too long. Parking means to park your car at illegal and designated places. Parking uphill and downhill. While parking uphill the wheels should be towards the road, so it would prevent vehicle from going down. If the car is parked downhill the wheels should be steered towards the curbstone for the same purpose. Changing direction by using U-turn and reverse. U-turn in one-way traffic has to be made from the extreme left lane only. If you are driving on two-way traffic and you want to change direction or make a U-turn, you can reverse your car for changing the direction. Things to remember when you leave your car. Your car at a proper parking place.